Hello, it's me, Jen, and I wanted to go over how to upload a video into your YouTube and then also how to put that video into your video widget on Digital Course Live. So this is my personal account. Um, so when I go to YouTube Studio, another really quick way you can do it, you can just click on this little button up here and click to upload video. But you can also go into YouTube Creator Studio, whatever it may be. And then we're gonna go ahead and select some files. Let me see if I have one here. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna just use the, oh, is it invalid? Oh, I know what I'm doing here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Here's an MP4. All right, these are just videos I'm editing right now, so I'm just using this one as a sample. But what you're going to want to do is put the title of your video. You can upload a custom thumbnail if you want. You can put a description if you want, but since these are most likely for your course and unlisted on the back end, no one's going to see that. I would definitely put, you need to put descriptions and use those keywords as I harp on you all the time. Um, for any sales videos or anything that's going to be public view facing. Um, no, this is not made for kids at the bottom. And then you're going to click on the next button for your video in and of itself. You don't really need to worry about any of this. It will check for any privacy issues. And then you're going to keep this as unlisted um, and you're going to save it. And once you, and then you're going to take, oh, don't forget to copy the link video link, and then you're going to save it. I'm obviously not going to save it because I don't want a client's video I'm editing, hey, big Jen and Cass, to be on my site. So um, now we're going to come down here into a uh, video widget. If you don't have a video widget on your site or on your page yet, you're just going to go over here to the add a widget section. You're going to click on the video and you're going to drag that wherever you want it to be. And then in the video source, you are going to put that video link. Now you can use a custom thumbnail if you'd like. These are all custom thumbnails that I did down on our testimonial videos here of Damani, or we have some more below. Um, but you can also just leave it as the video. It's really up to you. I like a custom th thumbnail because it keeps a cleaner look for you. Um, kind of like this versus having all the other information on it. Um, and that's it. You hit save and it is ready to go. Maybe a little test, a little test on the, run a little test over here, see how it looks, check it. There it is. Ooh. Perfect. It's playing. You can hear it and it's good to go. Um, again, if you have any questions or, or concerns, go ahead and click down in the comments section, leave us a comment, or uh, head on over to the Digital Course Hive Facebook group, where we will be able to assist you personally 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Not really, we do sleep, but we will get to you as soon as we can. Have a great day.